And once you know what those things are and what kind of life you want to have, then you can start shaping what your practice is going to look like, how much you're going to charge, what your packages are going to look like, who it is you're going to treat. But you have to start with the absolute end in mind um, and really decide for yourself, like, is this actually what I want? And then if it is, design your practice around it. Um, don't just charge low rates. That is uh, a false belief that a lot of people have where they think that, hey, I'm going to be cheap because that's going to get more people in the door. First of all, it's not. It's just as easy to sell a $100 thing as it is to sell a $200 thing or even a $2,000 thing. And if you're priced as the cheapest, nobody expects you to be the best. But if you're the best, no one expects you to be the cheapest. And if you start out your practice charging low rates because it feels more comfortable to you, it's what you would pay. What you're going to attract are people who only want to pay a low dollar amount of things. And that's going to start to shape your beliefs and your decisions inside your business. And you're going to get tricked into thinking that no one would pay $200 a session. Like none of my page, current patients right now would ever pay that. And you're right because you attracted people who only want to pay a hundred or $150. You would attract an entirely different kind of buyer when you're charging the, the premium rates because they're perceiving you as the best. You're attracting people who want the best versus someone who just wants it cheap. It's a completely different population of people. And so when you're starting out, if you decide to go this route, don't try to be a commodity. Otherwise, you're going to get treated as one and everyone's going to make decisions based off of convenience and price. If you want to be the best and you want to eventually be able to attract and retain the best staff and you want to have a life where you're not always worried about where your next dollar is going to come from or where your next patient is going to come from, you need to start out charging what it is you actually need to have that kind of life and practice that you want to have. Because if you build a whole practice around the wrong business that doesn't create your life, it's so much harder to turn that around and transition into that next level of business where you are premium and you are positioned as the best.